Welcome, Ophiosis. I want to say thank you for being here. If this is your first time, please remember to like and share and subscribe to the channel. Ophiosis, welcome back all um, newcomers. Welcome back. All right. So, Ophiosis, this is going to be a busy, busy period. Whatever is happening and transpiring, I see no new start for a cancer. So some of you are going to be recognizing that a cancer is going to be fired out of your corporation. Um, a lot of you could be firing a cancer. They're recognizing what a cancer have done. They have recognizing a whole lot of problems that a cancer have created. Happiness and joy for you, Ophiosis, because finally you're going to be getting rid of this cancer. Whoever this cancer is, they're going to be recognizing the foul play of this cancer and what this cancer have created. A whole lot of you are dealing with dualities. You're dealing with a liberant and a cancer. I see regrets for a liberant. A liberant is no worry over some sort of a problems and situation that they have created. So, um, have faith. Um, this uh, quarter is from April, May, and June. And uh, this is for um, the second quarter of the year 2021. Have faith. Your prize are manifesting rapidly. Um, uh, remain positive and follow your guidance. So whatever is happening in uh, this uh, month, uh, um, you Ophiosis have to recognize that following your guidance is going to be very, very important. Uh, your guidance is going to be the leader. You're going to be listening and following your guidance because a whole lot of things, a whole lot of situation is happening, Ophiosis, in the spirit. And it's about finding a fate and recognizing that uh, um, fate is going to be leading your way. Listen to your own intuition and uh, explore the opportunities around you in uh, this timeline. Okay, so fate is going to be playing um, a, a huge role. Have faith, have faith in yourself, but have faith in the universe most of all, because by having faith in the universe, that is what is going to be helping you to move forward. So, um, good work. You have been asking and praying for um, some big dreams to come true. And yes, it is. Uh, yes, it is going to be working out. So just like uh, a gardener who has uh, planted new seeds, uh, you must have faith uh, that your crop will push about the surface. Keep watering your dreams by taking the steps uh, and making them flourish okay so this is going to be good it's going to be a positive alignment of energy the universe is going to be creating a lot of stability um for a lot of you big dreams are going to be happening for a lot of you ophiosis finally 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 you got rid of a, a cancer whoever this cancer is so let's look and see who you're going to be dealing with a lot of you could be dealing with the Cancers and the Pisces in this timeline. Um, and when we look, I see a lot of you are going to be dealing with the, um, the Aquarians, uh, the Librans, um, the Leos, um, the Tauruses. So, um, expect that the Leos expect that in the month of April. So in the month of April, a lot of you are going to be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, people between the age of 18 and 45. Um, a lot of you could be dealing with a Scorpion in April between the ages of 18 and 45. Um, a lot of you are going to be dealing with the Aquarians in the month of April, and you're also going to be dealing with the Leos and the Taurus in the month of April. So be aware an alert of these people. I see a lot of regrets for a scorpion. Whoever the scorpion is and whatever is transpiring, a scorpion have now recognized a whole lot of regrets. The scorpion is regretting what they have done. Whoever the scorpion is and whatever is transpiring is regretting what they have done because they have created a whole lot of mess and the scorpion is now aware of the mess that they have created. This is a young person between the ages of 18 and 45. And they're now recognizing how they have created a whole lot of mess. For what reason? Um, was it jealousy? Was it just trying to get back at someone? But they themselves now regret um, the huge problems that they have created for a whole lot of people. And now is recognizing 
um, the problem for them to move forward in the future is not going to be as easy because of what they have created. So be aware of that. Then when we look at the month of May, the month of May, a lot of worries. A lot of you are having worries over a contract, whatever is happening and transpiring. A lot of you, of you are having worries over a contract, whether or not a contract is going to be extended. Um, a whole lot of worries is coming up. A whole lot of you are worried about, uh, um, you know, you, you moving forward in a corporation institution. If you're going to be receiving a job, if you're going to be receiving some new business, if you're going to be receiving new contract and a whole lot of problems, um, that has been happening and is transpiring. So truths are going to be coming out about a cancer, whoever this cancer is. I see a cancer is very worried in, uh, the month of May. Whoever this cancer is, um, they are now, um, you know, they, whatever it is they have done, um, is coming out in the month of May. And this cancer is now panicky, panicky, panicky. A whole lot of worries in Zama, a whole lot of worries and in Zama for this, uh, um, for this cancer because they're now recognizing that, hey, they have done something and now Everything is coming out and people are now recognizing um, um, that it's as if this cancer recognized that they have called. So you Sagittarian is on to this cancer. Whatever this cancer have done, you Sagittarian have now a whole lot of information and is freaking this cancer because you have information of what a cancer have done and how a cancer have created a whole lot of issues and problem for the work floor. And you are going to be decided in the month of May um, not to um, give and 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 uh, and create any new and or extend any cancer new contract. A lot of you are going to be firing or getting rid of a cancer. You're going to be making this decision in the month of May. Then when we look at the month of June, the month of June is that conflicts, conflicts. Uh, and um, this cancer recognize uh, that their contract is not going to be extended and is creating a whole lot of conflicts in June. Um, I see that you Ophios has decided that a Libran and a cancer is not going to be, their contract is not going to be extended. And whatever has uh, create this situation is that you recognize that these people have not been carrying their weight and you recognize that these people have not been um, honestly, uh, keeping, uh, happiness and joy on the work floor. And you recognize that this cancer and this Libran has been creating a whole lot of issues and creating chaos. And now I see they're going to be regretting what they have done. They're definitely going to be regretting what they've done. And I see a lot of people and a lot of you Ophiosis are trying to bring back balance, teamwork, or stability. Um, positive uh, flow of uh, work energy um, within your department or within your company. And I see that you, Ophiosis, has been watching this Cancer and the Scorpion for a very long time. A Cancer and a Scorpion and a Libran. A Libran and a Cancer is now so worried because they have now put the puzzle. You, Ophiosis, have now got and put the puzzle together and recognize what this Cancer and this Libran have created and what they have um, created for a Scorpion. And a Scorpion is now regretting um, ever being connected in whatever way with these people, whether on the work floor um, out of work, um, you know, you're really worried. You're very, really, really worried and really recognizing how um, these people have created some sort of a inacceptable situation for a whole lot of people on the work floor. So I see that a lot of you, Sagittarian, have now gotten all the information, all the pointers, all the information Put the puzzle together when working this out looking at uh, whenever there is peace uh, um in your department or peace in the company is whenever a cancer and a liberal isn't there you ophiosis are also recognizing um well a scorpion a liberal a cancer and a sagittarian a gemini have created and i see all of these people are worried 
because you obviously are onto these people. You obviously are recognizing and it's really onto these people. So there is a whole lot of conflicts and a whole lot of conflicts. And this Libran is you're making sure you obviously are making sure that this Libran will never, ever have a new start in any other corporation institution because of what this Libran have created um, and caused the issues and problems um, in, you know, your company, your department or your team. And you are recognizing that, you know, you need to make and create some sort of a shake up um, because you're recognizing that uh, you need peace, harmony and balance. You want people to be on teamwork. Teamwork is what makes the dream work. And, and you opiosis are recognizing I need to get these people or get um, these people or out that is creating a whole lot of issues and problems uh, for my corporation. And this I need to resolve in this second quarter. So it's as if the first quarter comes up where these people was creating a whole lot of issues and a whole lot of instability. Um, and now you're recognizing how unsavorably these people have been really creating a whole lot of issues and problems. And that now you're standing up and recognizing, no, 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 I don't want to have this anymore in my corporation. This uh, this sort of an issue and situation is going to be leaving. So in the month of June, it's always off year. I see a lot of you are going to be cutting costs by firing a lot of people. I see these people are want to create some sort of an issue, but I see that as of April, a lot of you, um, by seeing the, um, you know, um, your um, profit and loss, uh, a lot of you are going to be deciding to uh, release yourself or release your company from the people who have been just dragging their weight and haven't been doing anything of significance. So I see a lot of worries is going to be coming up for a lot of people. A whole lot of worries is going to be coming up for a lot of people. Um, they're going to be now recognizing that you know, they have been playing and having their personal, um, personal, up, um, you know, just creating, having their personal, um, agendas that was not, um, a part of your organization because you wanted people to come together and work as a team and work as a family. And, um, you know, they were creating a whole lot of issues. Uh, um, for the setting of what you had hoped for in your corporation institution or in the department or in the, the team working that it wasn't there because these, this cancer and this liberal have created a whole lot of issue. Now for this cancer and this liberal, there is no new start. And I see that you're going to be, whatever they have done, you ophiosis are going to be making sure that they never ever get another job. Um, in any organization that has to do with, you're going to be making sure um, that, you know, a, a, a red ink is placed behind a Libran and a cancer name because of uh, what they have done and create in your corporation institution. Now, regrets for a, a scorpion, whoever the scorpion is, is very regretting, regretting something, regretting uh, um, because the scorpion is going to be losing out because the scorpion has been a member of the and, and, and has been working together um, with um, this Libran and this um, Cancer. Um, a Gemini is now very, very worried and a Gemini now regrets. Um, a Gemini have a whole lot of regrets that they have created. Um, some sort of a conflict against um, against people on the work floor. And, and, and this Gemini is now very worried. I see regrets for this Gemini, a whole lot of conflicts with a Cancer. A Gemini on the work floor could have collaborated with a Cancer and is now recognizing that they have made a huge, huge mistake. So however this is coming up and it's transpiring, Ophiosis, I see you're taking the lead. I see you're um, really taking the lead and really bringing some sort of a transition um, in your world and in a corporation institution in order for bringing back balance um, for this corporation institution because it has been um, 
blowing out of proportion where people had their own agenda. You're going to be getting out all of these people. So, Ophiosis, I want to say thank you for being here. Show your love by Tom's album. Ophiosis, find people who were born um, November 29 um, to December 17. You are the Ophiosis. You're going to be the leaders of uh, this new era that is coming in. Start letting people know that. I do love you guys. Gotta go. Namaste.